Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Martin and welcome back to another episode of Blue's Tower Defense 6. Uh, on today's episode, as I have promised, I'm going to be um, trying to achieve the Paragon for the Buccaneer. Um, as you can see, I have unlocked the Buccaneer, which is called Navarch of the Seas. I might be pronouncing that wrong. Um, but yeah, without further ado, let's let's begin um i think one of the most important aspects is definitely choosing a good map that has a good balance of water and land um just be, just because uh through my attempts of uh grinding xp i definitely find that uh just soloing with um with the navy or the buccaneer ship is definitely not the easiest thing to do um yeah so the first time which was the episode that i uploaded um i think i believe i died at like round 63 or something like that and then on round and then on the second attempt which i played earlier today um i actually died i believe on round 80 something uh, so as a result, definitely needing to alter my strategy a bit and see how things go. Full speed ahead. Um, so first things first, I guess, you yeah. know, gotta get, gotta get a hero. Um, although this is not my favorite hero, I think its ability does help with uh, increasing nearby water damage the water based monkeys for a short time um, increasing its attack speed um whether or not i actually get the monkey this episode uh, i guess you'll have to find out soon um but yeah if you're new around here please consider hitting the like button and also clicking subscribe that would be greatly appreciated um yeah, one like to hopefully get me the Paragon. This one's definitely going to be a hard one. I have no doubts about it. Um, let's see. So what I did in the, in the second attempt was uh, at least the map that I chose that there was enough of um, what you might call it double, double path crossing of paths or um, areas like this where you can hit multiple air uh, multiple spots. So as a result, I was able to get a simply just purchased a um, tax shooter and then upgraded to the fire and it was you know able to deal a lot of damage in that way um i think this time around i might go with the crossbow monkey to see how things go um but yeah for sure i don't think they'll raise i think Hitting a Dartling Monkey would be helpful, um, especially since this this line of fire is just, yeah, really helpful. Um, so far, this guy, Admiral Perko, is doing fine. Um, but I did mention previously in another episode that I think it was the f the episode where I did you know try out Admiral Perko. Um, Admiral Bricka was definitely not my uh, preferred preferred choice of hero. Um, so we'll see how it goes. Um, I yeah, the previous two attempts I used size. I it's definitely one of my new favorite um, new favorite uh, hero. Um, oh already slight issues already um as you can see oh no okay 
slow this down. Can I get another? Yes, I can. Okay. Let's get another ship. Um, let's upgrade this ship to another buccaneer. And then let's continue. Um, let's go for fireball and that should be fine for now. And then, well, thankfully, as long as I survive rounds, I rege regain the shield. So no issues there. Sorry about that. Um, I think over the weekend, as I was working out, I did receive a slight injury. So utilizing this hot pad um, to relieve re relieve some of the pain, um, which definitely helped. Um, all right, let's resume this madness. Um, yeah. So there, there was that a bit of awkward silence, just because like my mom came in. And yeah, but nonetheless, this hot pad. Oh, it's very hot. Ooh. Um, but it's been helpful. Um, I did it. It was a lot more painful in the morning. Um, but after I utilized it, it was a lot better. Uh. Let's see, let's slow down this and I think let's start upgrading this guy. Um, let's go for another, let's go for another monkey farm. So I, so the plan is, is definitely find something that will help me deal damage or eliminate the balloons but not be the main pop because in order to get a higher tier of the paragon all the pops needs to be from the uh buccaneer ships um, so as a result yeah it's definitely gonna be a bit tedious um i think what i would like ooh, not even realize it was round 40 but thankfully that was no problem there um i'm gonna save up for a monkey pirate instead of upgrading it to the monkey bank just because um higher levels the monkey near ability would be very helpful um boom. and then let's go for a druid back here that, and then upgrade that to the um oh, druid of the storm that's what it was words are not my forte seems like okay there we go and then let's go for another fucking new ship Ooh. Okay, so that should be helpful. And then let's invest in another. Let's invest in another. What should we call it? Ah, there we go. Monkey farm. All right, so four should be fine for now. Then let's okay slow down again, um, just so I can 
get another give me a ship Boom, 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 boom. All right, and then let's, can I, yes, I can fit another one here. Um, which is great. Being able to stack the front. And then now let's see, can I fit another one here. Nope, you can't fit another one there. All right. Um, let's see. Uh, let's get that to. So I believe that should start hitting crits. So that should be fine. And then uh, let's get a sniper. So glad you can have the sniper anywhere. Put that faster firing caliber. So that should help with. Uh, hitting the balloons, especially later down the road, and then now um, to continuously just get more canoe ships. I swear I saw for a moment there's a spot that I could the ship on. Just trying to utilize and go into an advantage of you know all the spots you know what i mean so that i can be efficient with my placing um, but that's also one of the issues with the buccaneer ship it's just so big that it's, it's a bit tedious oh come on okay let's slow this down um just so i can have the opportunity to place towers um let's upgrade one of these guys to the monkey bank and then faster shooting boom 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 so ideally i think the ones that are closer you would want it to be to be the this destroyer just because like um you don't have or at least i don't have uh I don't have it as it doesn't have the uh long range ability as the other one at least the way i'm setting it up as um because i think just as important as the um yeah in order to achieve the full potential of power. of the buccaneer the grape is definitely important. Okay. Let's go for another monkey bank. Select all. And then let's. I guess continue placing down ships. That's more or less all I can do. Speed that back up. Crow's nest. Um, I think I should upgrade this in a bit okay I don't really know oh there we go I my all right managed to beat this but that's not the end of it as as usual all right let's continue boom 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 more boom 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 all right so I think I should be good for now. I think round 63 is one of the harder ones. There we go. Um, and then from last I played, I should be good until round 80 something. Forgot which. 
which round it was specifically. Um, but yeah. Yeah, so the pirate ships ideally do more damage. Whereas the the other one the nah, what's the word? Uh destroyer, that's the word. That's the the destroyer would do more I guess balloon popping damage. Um, but realistically, eventually, I think I would want one, one, uh, I think eventually I would want to replace the warrior with the, um, uh, uh, and pirate ships, that's what it's called. But I mean, I think realistically, if I can achieve the, the goal um, should be fine um let's have this this guy's the uh this guy is my bottom path gotta not forget to use that um, okay slow down slow down and then let's get more pirate ships. Boom, boom, boom. And then let's get another. Let's get another monkey bank. Let's get two monkey banks. Boom. Boom. And then let's get more ships. More ships, more popping power, more popping power, more damage, more damage. Hopefully earlier. And dealing. Earlier in receiving the actual... Uh, Aragon ship, that's what it's called. Alright, um, so far so good. Ooh. Yeah, I think I definitely need to buff this bottom side more. But unfortunately, there's, there's not much room on the bottom to place. So, I'm gonna start. Buffing the bottom. No, we're not buffing the bottom, buffing the back. Yes. Maybe this was like a not the best map. Cause I was trying to find something that had a good good uh good mix of land and Land and uh, what you would call it, see, just so I can get assist. Oh, as you can see, there we go. Um, round 78 this time. Um, yeah, I don't really want to upgrade this. I mean, I don't really want to pay. Well. That is unfortunate. I'm trying to see, cause yeah, I don't think um you can get the Paragon in sandbox mode. Paragon, Paragon, Paragon. This guy. That 
guy takes up a big amount of space. Yeah, so you can achieve Paragon. I think that is unfortunate. Uh, maybe, maybe I should have paid for it. All right. Um, I guess let's play. Let's play the Odyssey. See how things go. I was indeed unfortunate. Oh, actually, no. The Admiral here. Admiral on deck. Oh, you. Oh, see, I was hoping to utilize this straight path and. Well, never mind that. Yes, Admiral will be Admiral here. And then let's put this guy here. Uh, that was unfortunate. I didn't go as far as my other attempts, which is a bit sad. My other attempts definitely went a lot further than this, around 78. Um, I think part of it was because I was just a bit too focused on getting the uh, getting getting towers down that I've that I didn't buff up. Yeah, so that that map because it's so un it's a bit uneven. Um, the the bottom map was uh, the bottom part of the map was a bit more vulnerable compared to the top. Um, so as a result. Was definitely a bit harder to to achieve what I wanted. Um, realistically, I don't think I need. Realistically, I don't think I need the alchemy. Um, I might do more research to see what would be like the best combination of how many monkeys. Um. Maybe also attempt, attempt it off camera to see, and then maybe just record the portion I do get it. Um, if I do, if I can. Uh, but yeah, I'll definitely try again in trying to receive the Paragon. Uh, yeah, because uh, from what I've seen so far, I think at least some people say it's OP. Uh, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised because it's like it's five, five, five. Right, a lot of the paragons so far has been OP. Alright, um, choo -choo -choo -choo. that should cover more or less of the entire map. Honestly, I have no idea what I'm gonna do on this. Just guess I think the uh, the Moab will be tough. And then now I also gotta figure out what else to record. Um. Just because I did beat Wolfenstein the Old Blood. Um, I can download Wolfenstein 2, but I also kind of want to stream that instead. Uh, I have a lot of games that I would prefer streaming or, yeah, utilize as streaming content. Um, just because, yeah, at least from what I've seen online. Or one of the tips that I received online is that you don't want to, um, you don't want to stream something that is a lot of people streaming on, 
um that's because as a result it'll be difficult for you to i guess be exposed um Oh shoot. Is that the end? Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Um Put this down. something that would help me in dealing with and this guy deal uh you can't your only top path I didn't even realize what that helped me deal with deal with lead that's my concern. Otherwise, I may need to get the um, what you might call it, um, the bureau. Oh, yes, it does. Okay. Don't need to worry in that way. Oh. But yeah, I am slightly disappointed that I couldn't get it. Um, so for that map, it was because of Camel. Um, I think because it was a bit of a uneven distribution. Oh. Hmm. Apologize. Um, because of the even dis dis distribution, oh, I can't even speak. Ooh. Am I gonna be able to? Yes. Yes, let's go. Yeah, so because of the uneven distribution on the map, it was definitely a bit harder. Um, but yeah, a lot of the maps going to be a bit tough uh, in, in receiving and achieving the Paragon. Um, there, there isn't any map that is super ideal for it. Um, as you can see, a lot of them, I think this might be better, but the, the grass, the lily pads will definitely affect it. Um, this is a very short map. So as a result, a lot of, a lot of things, a lot of the, uh, uh, balloons can get to the end really quickly if you're not prepared. Uneven distribution. Yeah, would, the water ones would definitely be a lot tougher. I've always expected the water paragons to be tougher. Just because there's more land than water. But yeah, if you have enjoyed, please consider hitting the like button and clicking subscribe. Uh, I will be continuing to achieve this but maybe not every single episode to be able to uh diversify it but yeah um that's it for now goodbye